Yo guys, what's up? Today I'm doing a little update video. I uh, haven't done one in a few days. And I decided I'm going to start out by, like, when I start out these videos, I'm going to show you guys my Beast Kill tab, just because I am mainly a PVMer. I'm going to show this at the beginning of every video so you guys will see what I've done in my progress. Um, last video to this video, I don't really remember what I've done. I did a little bit of Zami because I got a task for it and I got, like, five items. Um, no Bandos, maybe a little bit of Zilliana. And I think that's it. Um, yeah, I haven't really done much in the past few days. I've just been doing a uh, fire making. I got 99. Um, include that target now. Got 91 at my Citadel, and I'm about 15 million XP in Slayer. I don't really remember what else I've done. Uh, I got a little bit of cash, more cash because I sold my Slayer tab. I uh, had about a 13, 14 mil Slayer tab, I think. Um, if you look at my bank, you'll see two War Priest items, Zami ones, right here. Um, I got those on the same death task at Zami, and I got like three other items too. It was a crazy fucking task. Um, I'll actually see if it's in the adventurer's log, because it was literally within like 20 kills. It was so great. Um, if my adventurer's log even works anymore, it usually just logs one day. Uh, but actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to go get a death task real quick. Um, and in getting this death task, it's the last one I need uh, for Hydrix. Actually, I don't even know if I have a task. Uh, yeah, gloves of subjugation, piano of subjugate. Oh, it doesn't show the uh, um, war priest in here. Okay. Well, I did like 28 core or Zami kills, got two items and two war priest items and two shards. So it was actually pretty good. Um, the gown was two, two point four mil, I think it sold for, and the gloves were just like okay, something like that. So a decent amount of money. Um, I actually don't even remember if I got a task yesterday or not. Let's see if I can get a task. What brings you? No. Task. No, I'm not doing legions. If it's Araxia, I'm going to cry. Ew, Zillian. Okay, I guess we'll do those. Um, this task is really kind of annoying. Because the drops are absolutely garbage. Uh, what else do I need? Bring everything. I was doing kind of a, a Jadinko task yesterday, last night, and that's it. Get Ring of Wealth and a sign. Um, these, by the way, if you've seen in my bank, I carry them all the time due to the fact that uh, just you die. It's basically a lifesaver. Um, Ring of Wealth, obviously. Bone Crusher. I'm going to bring this with me because they drop bones. I don't need them. And Summer Pie is just for healing. Although I've I've come to realize it's not a good idea for RS3 PKing or, or PVMing because the more you eat, the less adrenaline you get. And I completely just spaced out on that one. I completely forgot that it drains your adrenaline. Adrenaline the more you eat. Yeah. So um, let's get you. Let's get you. You and I'm not gonna record this entire trip. I'm just going to record the uh, finishing of it, I think. Actually, no, I'm going to use Shark, whatever. I believe that is all I need. Yep, so I'll be back when my task is complete, guys. See you then. Oh, and also something I always want to talk to you guys about. Um, As you can see, I record in fixed because my monitor is too big to record in resizable. And it's really a pain in the ass to record in resizable because just a lot of stuff zoomed out and it doesn't really look that good in my opinion. Um, so I'm recording in fixed. It's better quality in my opinion. And also I prefer fixed mainly because I just like the uh, um, old style. But I have a very nice setup that I like for legacy as well. I just re prefer to record in... Or I have a very nice setup for RS3. I just prefer to record in legacy. Um... But yeah, and also I like to record in um, Legacy Combat whenever I can because just this part of the screen is not taken up and um, I just enjoy Legacy every now and then. So yeah, pretty much it. Um, but I will return with you guys whenever I finish the task. So I'll see you guys then. Hey guys, so sorry, I was kind of not really prepared for this. Um, I got War Priest Gauntlets from a minion. Um, there's the actual boss drop, um, but yeah, War Priest items from Minion. 
And also, I want to say something. I was an idiot the first part of this fucking trip because I completely fucking forgot about my overloads, like half of the kills, and they were taking like a minute each, and I was just blowing through food. Um, yeah, I'm just a fucking idiot. So I decided to just finish out the task in Legacy because it's kind of more. I just prefer it, and it's also almost easier. I've noticed I don't eat as much, and uh, um, I just left the room and came back in with normal spawn rate so it's a little bit slower but I got six left um, I've gotten a whisper and that war priest you just saw it's the only items I've received uh, I now have a total of three war piece war, war priest items I got them overnight like in this like I've been at Ceridome and Vandos and Zami for like 700 kills in total and I've gotten the three kill or the three war priest items in the past 24 hours within like 100 kills so I'm just kind of like bruh the fuck? I don't even know the drop rate on them. I thought they were probably like 1 in 500 or something, but got two in the same task last, task last night, so probably not. Um, but yeah, so six more, well, technically five, and um, I'll be back whenever I finish that. So I hop worlds and come to a world that has no minions and just the Zilliana herself. Um... I thought she spawns with minions, but I guess not. Um, yeah, so I only have three kills left. I'm just going to narrate the last uh, three because I need to talk about some stuff. Uh, there they are. Uh, my account, I don't really know what I'm doing with it. Um, or not my account, my like streaming. Not streaming. Ugh. YouTube channel. I don't really know what I'm doing with it. Um, I'd like to do uh, some like PVM, PKing, just everything, skilling, everything like that. I might also do some excuse me, streaming, um, which that's how you get your channel known, so it'll actually help out my channels by streaming. Um, I don't really know how to, nor do I really have the time to right now because I'm working so much and all that. Um, but soon I want to start streaming, and I don't know, stream like boss, bossing, stuff like that, PKing, I don't even know. Um, but yeah, so just in the future I'd like to start streaming, and I'll obviously put a video up every time I am, so it can be like, yo... I'll start streaming, go ahead and come over and take a look if you want, blah, 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 um, and yeah, so, uh, I don't know if I really said earlier, I think, I'm pretty sure I did, this is the last task I need for Hydrix, and I don't know what I'm doing with that, actually, I'm thinking about just actually buying the, uh, 25% less instant costs, um, which is 250, which, it would be nice, it would save money in the long run, but right now, I really want the Hydrix, because, I mean, I can sell it for, I think, like, 15 mil or something, and that's a good, good, good chunk of money. And uh, I don't even know what I'd spend it on, but I just have an extra 15 mil sitting around, which would be helpful. And actually, I'm going to turn off that. Um, I think this actually is the last one. Uh, no, I think I have one more. Just, but yeah, so I'm thinking about buying the Hydrix. I might end up just buying the reduced instant costs and then the Rainbow Beam after that and then get a Hydrix. Um, but I'm pretty sure they're just going to be going down in price, so there's really no reason to wait for it. But then again, it's like if I bought the lower instance cost now and did this whole thing again to get another Hydrix, I'd save money on the instance costs. Um, whereas, because like I'm going to be doing more tasks anyway to get back to the in to buy, have more money to get the instance cost reduction. So it's like I might as well just buy it now and save money in the long run. Um, but then again, it's like a Hydrix is probably going to be a few mil cheaper in the long run, and I don't think I'm going to be saving a few mil with this instance cost thing. So I don't know. I'll figure it out when I get there. But yes, just got one more after this, I think. Um, let's just die. And then we'll be good. Got one more. Uh, I'd like to get an item on the last kill. It'd be kind of cool. Like a... What the fuck? Perfect timing for that shit. I think I have two of these in the bank right now anyway. And I don't know what they do. All I know is you bring them to Tusca and you get XP, like a normal meteorite, but it somehow hurts it, so I don't know if it aids me a lot or whatever. But, yeah, so I'm going to do it anyways. I mean, might as well. Take the meteorite. If it's like to okay, yeah, I already know that. Why are you telling me it again? And Johnny D, let's go. Last one. Let's go out with a bang. Get like an effigy, an elite clue. And a Ceridome and Hild. That would be fucking OG. I don't think you can get that much luck. And a Warpriest item on one of the minions. And a Shard on another minion. That'd be great. <laughs> I 
If that shit happens though now, I'm probably just gonna throw my computer. It's not going to, but whatever. Uh, nice 69 kill count to finish thing off. Things off. There's technically 40 more because I did leave to come back and do it in Legacy. Which Legacy, I'm pretty sure it's a lot slower, um, but it's a lot more like AFKable, and you don't use much food at all, so it's kind of nice. Um, but I don't know. I have to do some timing with stuff later. I haven't even timed it because it, it doesn't have the timer up there because it's Legacy. Um, so can't time it unless I do like a stopwatch or whatever. But whatever. Um, yeah. So this is the last one of the task. I have 300 points now. I don't know how many tasks I've done. It'll say here. It'd be cool if it was like on a 10 task. I got bonus 10 points or something. And let's go. Done. Sweet. All right. Um, you put this assignment. Oh, it doesn't say how many I've done. I guess. Okay. I thought I have it. Let's see if I can quick chat it. No matches. I I've completed. Oops. Oh god. Um, Reaper assignments. There we go. 27. Okay. Uh, three off of the um, one thing. Also, I kind of want to buy the double tasks because it's like I could get so many more points that way in the long run. So it's just like I don't know what to buy because there's so many different things that I want from there. Um, but yep, there's a Reaper task done. I've got 12,000 Slayer experience creeping up on 5 mil. And let's go. Oh, let's actually just bank all this shit. Nope, nope. That's not what I wanted. Over to death. I have a friend here. Oh, Johnny D. Mr. Johnny D. There he is right there. Don't even know who the fuck that is. He might even, I don't even know if he's in my clan, honestly. No. I don't know who the fuck it is. But he's on my friends list, so I'll use him. But yes. Let's go rid of you because the OCD don't need you anymore bye now I have to heal up alrighty I don't want I want to buy I want to buy Hydrix because it's 15 mil but I don't because I want the double tasks and then I want the lower instances and eh, rewards hmm can't get anything here Ah, it's like, I want the instance, and I also want the additional task, but I also want the rainbow loot beam. Uh, or a Hydrix. Uh, can I actually buy, hold on, can I buy these with Slayer points? No, I cannot. I can buy this with Slayer points. So I'm going to buy that with Slayer points. And then that means I need another 400 points for these two things. It's like, if I get an additional task now, it'll go by so much faster. But I just don't want, <laughs> I want the Hydrix. I could have bought that forever ago. I, oh, I'm get, fuck it. I'm getting a Hydrix. Reaper points. Okay. We have a Hydrix. Oh, I have to add an Onyx to it. Yes, I'm going to make a Souls Amulet. Okay. Go there. Go there. 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 Oh, God. All this stuff is going there. I'm not doing this one at a time. Actually, War Priest, you can say. There. Bam. Okay. So this, I need to get an Onyx, and then I need to enchant it, and I'm going to make an Amulet of Souls. And hell, I might even keep the Amulet of Souls. Because it's a good, good Amulet. It has, like, the highest stuff in the, highest stuff in the game. I don't know. Onyx. Let's get an uncut Onyx. Let's get some more crafting experience. Bam. Should I use it on there? Okay. Cut. 99 crafting. Let's go. No. No, 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 no. Creating uncut Hydrix. It's a cell for. No. Cut the Hydrix. 99 crafting. Let's go. Craft. No. Why are there Hydrix bolt tips? Holy shit. Okay. Then I need a mold, which I have. String. I need a, I need a string. String? Is that it? 
Is that how? It, is that what it is? String. What's this ball of wool going to? Ball. I, oh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Before it actually sells for 10k. Oh, okay. So I need to. No. Pick it up. I can't string this right now, can I? No. I have to make an amulet. So I need a gold bar. God, it's been so long since I've done any crafting like this. This is pathetic. Okay. Okay. And because I'm so lazy, I don't want to have to go walk somewhere. I'm going to use one of my forges. I have 12 of them, so we're good. Deploy, portable forge, deploy. All right, smelt. Whoa, 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 whoa. 99 crafting. Fuck. Okay. I can assist this, right? Oh, fuck. Uh, dude, does anyone have 99 crafting? No. So now he has a fire cape. Sheehan. Ah, oh, that's really annoying. All right, I'll be back in a bit. All right, guys, we got the amulet, and we had two of those things right there. By the way, I don't know if you saw that or not, but yeah, we had two of them. Um, and also got the amulet. Um, got it assisted from some guy over here. Time to enchant. Twenty earth, fire, one cosmic. I don't have any cosmics. I don't think. Or earth, or fire. Yep. GG. Ah, uh, Earth Rune. T. Cosmic. That, and I'm pretty sure I have a fire battle stuff in the bank. So we're good. So I hope I do. Watch just the one I don't have. Oh, I do. We're good. Okay. Hydrix Amulets becomes an Amulet of Souls. What does this thing sell for? For... No. Okay. Well, we're going to try and sell it for... Let's do 5% under. There it is. There's Amulet of Souls. 18.2 mil. Made 17.2 mil on it. Because I did buy a Hon uh, Onyx 50 mil cash stack. Doing pretty good. And, um, I don't know what I'm going to do, but actually I have to go do something for my college real quick. They called, so I need to contact them and settle this all out. And, um, I'll return with you guys when I'm finished with that. Hey guys, um, I know I said in the last clip that I think I was going to come back to you in the future with a, uh, my next clip or whatever. Um, unfortunately, I believe I'm going to be calling the video here. Um, I'm getting 60, why am I getting 61 XP now? Okay, I thought it was 30. I'm going to be calling the video here. Uh, it's been 18 minutes long, so uh, it's decent amount, decent long, decently long video. And um, yeah, that's it. So thanks guys for watching. Um, I'll be uploading this ASAP, and uh, have a good day.